Hello everyone, welcome to Python Full Stack Course. In this training video, I am going to discuss the Python assignment operator. There are eight assignment operator that are equal, add an and, subtract and, multiply and, division and, modulus and, exponent and, and flow division. We will see all the operators with the help of example. So let us start with the help of example based on the assignment operator. Now first we will take the two number, let us say a equal to 30 and p equal to 20. These are the two numbers we will initially read. We just execute the command and we get a is equal to 30, b equal to 20 will be stored inside that variable. Now we will perform our operation. We can write a equal to b. So what will happen? The value of b will be stored into the a. Now value of a is become 20 and if I will print a, I will get a is equal to 20. A is equal to 20 that is going to be print. Next one is the complex statement that is a equal to plus equal to let us say 10. The equivalent meaning of this statement is a equal to a plus 10. But by using add and we can write a complex statement a plus equal to 10 which is equivalent to a equal to a plus 10. So if I compile this the value of a is increment by 10 and we will get a equal to 30. So just I print the value of a and now it is get updated with 30. So here I will get 30. Similarly we can subtract the value from a that is a subtract and the value that I want to subtract let us say I want to subtract 10 from a and then I am going to print the value of a. So it will print the value after subtraction that is 20. Initially value of a is 30 then subtract 10 from a that is 30 minus 10 will get 20. So 20 is been stored into the. Similarly we can perform subtraction. Similarly we can perform multiplication and division. So I write a multiply and with 5. So I am going to multiply a with 5. So value of a is 20. 20 into 5 that is 100. So if I multiply with 5, I will get a result 100. Similarly, we can perform division a division equal with let us say 10. So I want to divide the value of a with 10 and then I will print the value a. So 100 divided by 10 resultant value is 10. So it is 10. It is been stored. Now but it is converted into float because it is a division operation. So in this way, we can perform and add, subtract and, multiplication and, division and. For example, I will take two more number. Let us say c equal to 4 and t equal to 2. These two number I will take and then I will perform c exponent exponent equal to 2. And then I will print the value of c. So it will perform 4 to the power 2. So we will get a 16. Oops, the C is not declared because I have not compiled this line. So I just compile it, I will get result 16. So hope you understand this exponent and as good as we can do, let us say C floor division floor division equal to 4 and we will print the value c. Now the resultant value will be stored into the c and perform the floor division and. So now we will get a 4. So in this way we can operate the python assignment operator. I had explained with the help of example but still if you have any doubt you can post in the comment section so I will give more explanation on the python assignment operator. I hope you like the content or I save your time. Please support by sharing the video with your friends. If you are not subscribed my channel yet, then please do subscribe and press the notification bell icon to get the latest information. Thanks for watching this video.